what is the difference between the monocots and the dicots and what is the general sensation of the monocots? So as you can see here, the monocots have a single cotyledon, the dicots have two cotyledons. You can see the monocots have a long narrow leaf with parallel veins and uh, the dicots have a broad network of veins. In the monocot, the vascular bundles are all scattered if you take the cross section. And in the dicots, they occur in a ring. And the flower parts in multiples of three in monocots and in multiples of five in dicots. You can see this uh, difference is there. And uh, the main difference in homeopathy is that the dicot, they react to external circumstances and adaptation to that. So basically, you know, I feel stuck. Some, Somebody is holding me. I need to move. Or something is attacking me. I need to run. So something happening from the outside to which I need to respond or react. Whereas in monocots, it is a one cotyledon. So the idea is of breaking into two, separating, splitting, dividing, and therefore loss of stability, solidity. So in monocot, the person is not concerned more about what's happening from outside, but about his own stability and solidity. Am I going to be one or am I going to be split up? The monocots are having a fibrous root system, whereas the dicots have a tap root system. And what this means is that monocots are not so deep or firmly rooted. And uh, that's why their stability is uh, basically the question, am I stable or not? Or will I break? Will I fall down? Mm -hmm. Whereas, again, I told you, dicots are reacting to what is happening from the outside. So, my own solidity, my own stability is okay, but I have to deal with outside reality. But monocots are more concerned about keeping his own integrity with himself. Am I going to remain one or am I going to be split up or break up or part of me is going to go away from me. You see, am I going to remain whole or not? This is the main idea of the monocots. Okay. So therefore, the main words of monocotyledons are connected, being part of one, included, integrated, united, completed, and the opposite disconnected, excluded, separated, divided, incomplete, empty. And uh, also you can see a lot of attention seeking towards oneself. You know, look at me. I'm the life of the party. I need to be attractive. Because on the other side, you feel excluded or isolated. In the monocot, you can see concerned with his own stability. As if a part of le you leaves you, something is taken out of you, you know, you become incomplete. And uh, you see many grasses also come here in monocots, the gramini, for example. So you have the swaying and the unstable, uh, you know, state also.